All right, now we got Wyatt Hendrickson versus Mason Paris. Winner gets Nick Wazdowski. These two met at the US Open. Hendrickson jumped out to a 7-0 lead before Mason put up a football score, scored 20 unanswered, I think, to win 20-7. Hendrickson led the nation in pins this year in NCAA wrestling for the Air Force, where he earned All-American status. Now we're underway in the blue, Mason Paris in the red, Wyatt Hendrickson. And there's a sweep single attempt, but working short offense is Mason Paris. Tight crunch there and trying to take Wyatt through and does. And now holding him on his back, that's a lot of horsepower. For Mason Paris, just the two points. Man, the fight that Wyatt had to put up just to not go over for that long. It's such a tight head pinch position. Paris, so powerful. You see it in his wrestling, but this is a guy who is earning weightlifting records for Michigan athletics as a, as a freshman. Just unreal power. And he applies it well in his wrestling. Hendrickson, of course, attends the Air Force Academy in this city here in Colorado Springs, so got to wake up in his own bed. Cruise over here. Beautiful Colorado Springs, Colorado. There's a shot, high crotch, Hendrickson with good sprawl, re-attack on the dump is paired, boom, big dump for four. Man, if he gets that elbow, it's not gonna be fun. 6-0 Paris, and he's going to work on top. And it's just not a common position. I mean, it's probably every youth wrestler works out of that position some, but it's so rare to see that hold have such effect. But Mason has got it perfect. I mean, he's hitting it in the NCAA Finals. He's hitting it here in the World Team Trials Challenge Tournament semis. Works at a high level, worked in the Junior World Finals. Just incredibly good feel there. And his single leg is also incredibly effective as well. And when he gets those fakes going, he's really tough to stop. Power double from Hendrickson, but good sprawl. Now counter score attempt from Mason, can't get in. Forty to go here in the first period. Sweep single for Mason, down block for Hendrickson as he sprawls out of the way. Wyatt's hit two hard leg attacks where he's got to the hips. And I'm betting 90% of the matches he's, he's finishing on guys. But Mason's that upper echelon of heavyweight wrestling in, in the country and very, very likely the world. And it was Hendrickson was able to get to a, uh, that lead in the open match when he got on top. He was able to get a series of gut wrenches to open up to a lead, but now he's down six against Mason Paris. Okay, second period now. Hendrickson got to find a way, get himself back in this match. Mason Paris probably going to try to put it out, out, of, out of reach. Good fakes from Hendrickson.
Sweep single, Mason Paris. Now it's a single from Wyatt Hendrickson, trying to build up in, can't do it. Comes up with an underhook, but good head position for Mason Paris, gonna make it tougher. Wyatt to utilize. Double leg for Hendrickson, but straight on. Not the position you want to try to score. And then Mason goes left to right, but Hendrickson able to stop him. Elbow control now for Wyatt Hendrickson. Nice single leg there by Wyatt Hendrickson. He's going to get on top. Going to a lace here. Now can he get to a gut? It's 6-2 on the scoreboard. And Wyatt, one of the best top wrestlers in folk style. Can he prove the same in freestyle? There's that gut. Boom. 6-4. Can he get another one? Left to right. Almost had it to Wyatt Hendrickson. Goes again. Got it. 6-6. Six, six. He's still trailing by criteria. But this match just got a lot more interesting. He takes it through again. 8-6 Hendrickson. He can't stop the gut wrench. Mason Paris keeps going over. It's 12 to six. What a job by Wyatt Hendrickson. And Josh Chirella has got a brick. And he's gonna say, hey, was he out of bounds? Head touch. And you see Mason holding his ribs. He looks injured. And that's that squeezing power from Hendrickson. And man, from 6-0 to 12-6. And they're gonna look at it and they're gonna see it. If Mason's head hit out, that, that could negate some of those guts. Because he was on the edge for a while. Man, if you wonder if, if Wyatt's got a tight gut wrench, look at Mason Paris right now. Hold, holding his ribs. I'm talking with Coach Sam Barber before the tournament, he was like, yeah, we weren't sure if, we almost had to pull the plug on this. Wyatt was battling some things, some uh, little injuries, and then he had a ton of finals, and they weren't sure, and then Next thing you know, he enters, and here he is. He's up 12-6 on Mason Paris. So they're taking one off. So it's going to be 10-6. And they're going to get the time right. OK, time's right. 101, 10, 6. Hold up. Hey, go, go. Oh. Oh. Well, the chairman had said to go, and then they're saying stop. So they're getting the clock right. So criteria situation here, it's all twos for Hendrickson. So if Mason can get to 10 points, he will be in the lead. So a pair of twos, four ones, doesn't matter the combination. If he gets to 10, if Mason gets to 10, he'll be in the lead. All right, 109 on the score, so plenty of time. And Mason says, let me get to work. And there's gonna be one right away, but here they, okay. Into the table they go. And uh, we're all good here. The score, the, the scorekeeper, here, stop the clock. They're gonna have to reset that. So they're gonna have to look at, they should, right now they should go back and look. They're gonna look at it and figure out how much time. It's probably gonna be around a minute. Mason scored almost immediately. This guy, this guy stays in the game. He didn't even blink. So, 
10-7 is gonna be the score. Is seven, right? So they're gonna put up the step out point and that's gonna make it So Mason scored a point in just six seconds. And there he's firing again, double to single. Chest strap position comes up around the body. Two more for Mason. Can he get a turn? It's 10 to nine. And he's gonna let him up. So Mason just needs a point. It's like something got activated with Mason there. Almost scoring at will. There's a shot. Hendrickson trying to stop the onslaught, but he may have just went right into a scoring opportunity for Mason Paris. He's pulling that near ankle, pushing that head down. A lot of weight, a lot of pressure. And now trying to run behind. He's on the leg, finishing backside. Can he? He's trying to double off. There's going to be two for Mason. He's back in the lead. 11, 10, 25 seconds to go. Now 22 to go. Hendrickson's going to need to find a point. Two points. One won't get it done for Hendrickson. He's got to get to 12. 20 seconds remaining. Mason has clawed back. Catches the double leg. Front headlock position here for Mason Paris. 10 seconds. He can squeeze in here as Hendrickson tries to run towards the edge. He's got to be careful. Did he step out? They're saying one red, but criteria is still for Mason because of the four. And this has been such a great match. Four seconds to go. And the, the, the whistle's got to relax. You, know, you got your judge walking across here and they're blowing the whistle. Yeah, and the, the chairman giving the whistle an earful for not, you're supposed to look at the chair before you start and make sure everything's good to go. So right now they're discussing, I don't know if it's a scoring or if they want to give that step out point. So they're going to give the one to Y. It's 11-11. Paris leads by criteria. And wow, he was not looking. He was not looking. And oh my gosh, he doesn't get it. Time was up. But what? Where's the awareness? Mason was not looking. I, I don't know. They're, they can look, but time was up. But what was... So they're gonna look at, make sure time was up. It, it, it almost certainly was. 